Hi, welcome to the series Learn Excel in 24 hours. In this video, we will understand how to make a template file. Let us say our objective is to figure out the mileage that our car gives in a particular month. So we just start putting in the data headers, the major data headers that we need over here update, the odometer reading, the fuel in liters, price of fuel the amount, the kilometers and the mileage. Observe how I am inserting a comment in the fuel field because I want to specify that this is in liters. So I click on the right hand side, say insert comment and put in the comment. Once the comment part is completed, there is a little red mark on the top right hand side of the cell. Now we have the price, the amount, the kilometers, the mileage. Now we start filling in the first data row, then we take the second data row. The first data row won't have you know, any formula in the kilometers or mileage section. That comes in in the second row of data. So I'm putting in the formula for kilometers, which is nothing but current odometer reading minus the previous odometer reading. And I put in the formula for the mileage, these many kilometers run divided by the number of uh, liters taken. Now we add some more rows of data. Once all this is done, we know that the price and the amount are currency fields. So we select the data and then we press Control 1 to open the format window. We select the currency format and say no decimals because we don't we are not really interested in the decimals for price and amount kilometers and mileage are number field so again select kilometers go to the format option we don't really need decimals in kilometers for the mileage function we are interested in dec uh, decimal points so we select the number field and apply the number format and choose two decimal points. Now as we proceed further, we just need to input the date, the reading, the fuel and the price. For the remaining portions to the right, we can just copy and paste from the previous row and paste it below. So by default in this case, the formula will get uh, pasted and everything is done. Now we come to the finishing uh, part for the template. We leave some rows in between. We specify total. We put in auto sum for the amount, the kilometers, etc. And now we start specifying the formats of the fields because by default what has happened is Excel has taken the auto sum uh, section and can put everything into rupees so we change and take out the portions where it should not be rupees the rest is about formatting observe how i am using the different kinds of text and cell formatting the borders the filling of colors etc just go through those it's a repeat of what we did in the initial part of the series in the end, once the template and the formula everything is done, we want to be able to reuse this. That's why this is known as a template file. So what we do is we click on file, save as and in the file type, we choose Excel template. Once it's a template, it can be used in you know multiple ways. That's the advantage of the template format. Thank you.